We've all been in this situation before. Tool changer, stop moving. There's a million reasons why this could happen. Loss of power, loss of air, somebody hits the reset button. I'm gonna show you how to recover from this using the tool changer recovery function on the Puma M560 OSP300. So on the control, the first thing we're gonna to wanna to do is go into manual mode. Once in manual mode, you look for a black button on your control that says machine operation. You may have to navigate to one of the different screens up here. I'm gonna look for the one that says ATC above it. Once I'm in that screen, I should see a box here that indicates what tool is currently in the spindle, what tool is being positioned. So this is where I can navigate around, try to get myself out of this situation and back into operation. You'll see several keys down here. I'm looking for one with the green flag above it. Anything with the green flag indicates that I can take a step forward or step return. This is one step advance. When I push it, I know that the machine's gonna move. I wanna be a safe distance away, not have anybody in the way. These mechanical motion is quite aggressive on some of the tool change functions. I may have to hold it down. I may have to touch it multiple times. I'm gonna see my sequence number change. This I'm watching, I wanna see this, get the sequence number one, and I wanna see cycle start okay. Now I've got sequence number one written up here. Start okay is good. The other thing I really wanna check is I wanna visually check and make sure that tool that is in that spindle matches right here. This says that I should have tool number one in the spindle. I know that I programmed this machine to set this up as tool number one. As long as that says cycle or start okay, I know that I'm back in recovery and can start operation. This may not work for every situation. You can have instances where chips have gotten caught up you can have some times where mechanical switches are starting to fail. If you see an uh, information in this dialog box, you can call us at 1-800-HARTWIG and talk, we'll talk you through navigating how to diagnose these issues. That's gonna be a service call. So 1-800-HARTWIG, press two for service. Let them know your serial number, what machine you're working with, what you've done so far to diagnose it. And any information that's in here will be extremely helpful. We'd be happy to help you recover your machine.